Have you ever heard of the discovery of soft tissues found in dinosaur bones? No, I haven't. Best case scenario, it still falls apart. Why? Because the second law of thermodynamics. So the fallback position is, well, maybe there's a mechanism for preserving these biomolecules that we haven't yet understood. The soft tissue that Dr. Schweitzer discovered is from a T-Rex that was buried in the Hell Creek Formation in Montana. Now this whole Hell Creek Formation is considered to be more than 65 million years old. So how did they calibrate their they, radiometric methods? They, they calibrate them based on the assumptions that the world is old. If someone wants to make a claim that your position is not scientific, a lot of times that's based on their definition of science. One of the reasons as well that the uh, soft tissue is currently overlooked is because evolutionists have claimed, oh, we have an answer for that. Well, one of the things that we like to say in creation science is that floods form fossils fast. The fact that all the fossils in the strata, we have the strata all the way up to the top of the strata, most of the fossils, over 95% of them are marine fossils. So the fossil record itself screams flood. Because there should not be any soft I mean, this is actually pliable, stretchy, elastic tissue after millions of years. I mean, there's just no way that can exist. So I think... I mean, the evidence, the scientific evidence, not only from soft tissue, but from molecular biology, from genomics, from every, every single area of biology is wrecking evolution at this point.